There are three main types of skeletons in animals. Endoskeletons are found in sponges, echinoderms, and chordates. It consists of internal hard supporting elements such as bones buried in soft tissue. Exoskeleton is found in most mollusks and arthropods. It is an external hard encasement deposited on the surface of an animal. Arthropod exoskeletons consist of 30 to 50 percent of polysaccharide chitin. The third type of skeleton is known as hydroskeleton, which is found in cnidarians, flatworms, nematodes, and annelids. Hydroskeleton lacks hard part and consists of fluid held under pressure in a closed body compartment. Annelids use their hydrostatic skeleton for peristalsis, a type of movement on land produced by rhythmic waves of muscle contractions. Adult skeletons contain 206 bones. There are 26 bones in the spine which consists of 7 bones in the cervical or neck vertebrae, 12 bones in the thoracic vertebrae, 5 bones in the lumbar vertebrae, a triangular bone called the sacrum, and the coccyx, which is the tailbone. The skull contains 29 bones, including 8 cranial bones, 6 middle ear bones, and 15 facial bones. The chest contains 26 bones, including the sternum or breastbone, and 12 pairs of ribs. The arms consist of 64 bones, including the shoulder bones, clavicles, and scapula. The upper arm bones, humerus. The lower arm bones, una and radius. And the hand, which contains 54 bones in total, 27 in each hand, including the carpals, metacarpals, and phalanges of the hand. The pelvic girdle contains 2 bones, and the legs contain 60 bones, including the femur, patella or kneecap, tibia, fibula, and the foot, which contains 52 bones, 26 per foot, including the tarsals, metatarsals, and phalanges of the foot. Some bones are connected at joints by ligaments that allow freedom of movement. Ball and socket joints are found where the humerus contacts the shoulder girdle, which enable the arms to rotate and move in several planes. Hinge joints, such as between the humerus and the head of the ulna, restrict movement to a single plane, and pivot joints which connect the ulna and radius enable the forearm to rotate at the elbow. A long bone consists of an outer shell of compact bone, also known as cortical bones. It is organized into osteons, and it appears yellow because its bone marrow stores fat. The inner layer of a long bone consists of spongy bones, also known as cancellous bones. They are made of microscopic element called trabecula. It appears red because its bone marrow contains blood cells. Osteoblasts are cells that secrete bone matrix and thereby build and repair bone, whereas osteoclasts are cells that reabsorb bone components and remodel the skeleton. Most animals are capable of locomotion, which means active travel from place to place. Walking, running, hopping, or crawling on land requires an animal to support itself and move against gravity. It requires powerful muscles, strong skeleton, and adaptations to maintain balance. In water, friction is a bigger problem than gravity. Fast swimmers usually have sleek fusiform shape to minimize friction. Swimming is the most energy efficient locomotion per body mass. Flying in air requires an animal to overcome the downward force of gravity. Wings are essentially airfoils that alters air current. Many flying animals have adaptations that reduce body mass. For example, birds lack teeth and a urinary bladder.